Danny Storm, Mike Ditello, the rise. And to keep these championships, we have to go back to our roots. Because the way the rise was formed was us two competing against each other. They say iron sharpens iron. And we're going to do that right here on Proving Guns. You ready? Storm versus Ditello. Do it, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Warriors of Wrestling Proving Grounds. Tonight, we have the rise. Usually on the same side of the ring in tag team competition. These are the Warriors of Wrestling Tag Team Champions. But right now, looking to square off against each other on the opposite side of the ring in order to enhance, sharpen their game. You know, as they said, this is how they get better. This is how the rise was formed. The rise was formed off of competition, going against each other, trying to one-up each other. And they said, you know what? Imagine what we could do if we work together. And we're going to see perhaps who is the better half of the rise. Right now we have Storm in control with the headlock countered by Mike Totello who grabs the hammerlock behind Storm counters into a hammerlock of his own spins him around and now it's Storm into a wrist lock so the Rise are not only your current Warriors of Wrestling Tag Team Champions they're also two times Tag Team Champions and you see that Mike Totello knows exactly what Danny Storm is going to do these two know each other so well they defeated the Midnight Classics to become Tag Team Champions in their first reign, and then defeated The Cause, Roger Mendez and Max Bain, to become two-time Warriors Wrestling Tag Team Champions. And now look at this, Storm knew exactly what Detello was going for and didn't let him get it. These two, look at that, both going for the same move, both know each other so well, and I think that's going to be a theme in this matchup. These two lock up in the center. Storm in control with the headlock. They became tag team champions at the aftermath of the Staten Island Street Fight, which is a grueling battle between the Rise and the Cause. Headlock takeover by Ditello. Storm able to quickly counter there. We've seen a lot of back and forth here in this matchup so far. Not, no man has been particularly in control as it's Detello utilizing Storm's momentum and now around into a headlock of his own. Great innovative offense there by Detello. Storm takes the headlock. Again, back and forth this matchup. Now it's Detello sending Storm off the ropes. Here comes Storm! Shoulder tackle to Detello. Detello going after him. Detello leaps up. Drop kick! Beautiful! Maneuver there by Detello. That's why I'm the better member of the ride. Oh boy. And the trash talk begins as Storm gets out of the way and Storm meets him with a clothesline in the corner. Storm sends him out. Oh! Come on, man! What the hell, man? Get the powerhouse of the rise right here. Oh, Mike said he was the better after the rise, and now a Storm on, claiming to be the powerhouse of the rise. And you just saw that by sending Detello straight into the turnbuckle as hard as he could. And that did a lot of damage to Detello. Detello is still on the ground now, and now it's Storm taking advantage. Gotta toughen him up. Gotta toughen him up for all the matches we got coming up. Come on. Storm. Looking to perhaps enhance Mike's skills. Trial by fire here. Sends him in the corner, looking for the same idea again, but this time Detello had a scouted arm drag. Storm was going to look to punish Detello again, send him into the corner, oh, but a strike just to put him down. And now Storm. Elbow to the shoulder, looking to damage his arm. And Storm goes after it again. Drills that knee into the spine of Detello. And Detello, right now feeling the effects. 
What are you gonna do? Oh. Right now we're seeing Storm trying to toughen him up, trying to throw him into the fire and see what Tatello can do. Remember, these two are the tag team champions. It's looking a little personal in this ring right now, but remember, these two form oh, off of competition, and that competition never ends. It's almost like a sibling rivalry. You know, they, they love each other, but this is always going to be in the back of their mind. Who's the better member of the Rise? As he went for a back body drop into Tello Sunset Flip 1 2. He almost had him. That could have been the end of the match right there. But Storm floors him with the clothesline. And now blaming Tello, saying he should have seen that coming. And once again, Storm here is throwing everything he can at Tello, trying to maybe test Tello, see what he has to offer. But Tello now sends Storm into the corner. Here comes Tello. Storm sends him over the top. He thought he sent him out all the way, perhaps, but went for a strike. Tello counter strike straight to the chin. Storm trying to grab him. Detello flips over the top, hits the ropes, and Storm floors him again. And essentially, what Storm just said there was that in the Battle Royal, the 14th year anniversary show of Warriors of Wrestling, it was Storm and Detello with the final two. And it was Storm who came out on top and he was saying that that was just like that battle royal. Way to stay in it, bro. Way to stay in it. Okay. And you see, even after beating down Detello, putting him through hell, Storm says he's proud of him for hanging in there. Again, it's an interesting dynamic between these two as they exchange strikes. Storm now sends him into the corner. Went for a splash there, but it was Detello moving out of the way. And here comes Detello, drop kick. Detello, second drop kick connects. And this could be Detello's opening. Has him with Storm. Moves out of the way. Has him up blue. Thunderbomb. One, two, no. Detello stays in it, showing his resilience to Danny Storm. Storm can't believe it. Detello's down. Storm is down. Two drop kicks, a blue thunder bomb. That match could have ended right there. Come on, Mike. Come on, Mike. And now Storm right back, continuing Mike. the tough love. Come on. Strikes to the face. The Tello might not be able to continue this match at this point. You gotta rise up. Storm. You gotta rise up, Mike. Telling him to rise up. And now a step to the back just to conflict more pain. And now here comes Storm whips him off, go, looking to floor him yet again, but when he ducked it, clothesline! Detello with the Detelbo! And now it's Storm trying to figure out where he is, and now here comes Detello! Strike! Forearm to the, to the face in the corner, and then Falcon Arrow! Could that be it? One! Two! No! The Blue Thunder Bomb couldn't wait, put away Detello! The Falcon Arrow couldn't put away Storm. What's it gonna take for these two? Who's gonna win this matchup? Each member of the Rise, the Tag Team Champions are putting it all on the line here on Proving Grounds. Going the distance. And Storm telling him to think about it. He went for the knee, went for the eye of the storm, went for a close like Thunder Punch! Thunder Punch! And the Tello with the knee! Both men giving each other their strongest strikes! And Detello, he may have been knocked out by that thunder punch, but in pure instincts alone, he bounced off the ropes, delivered a knee straight to Danny Storm, and the referee's count is up to eight. Both men trying to figure out where they are. They can't get up. That's the match. Both men are down. That's a tie. Both guys can rise up.